Grade 3 math, lesson 31, multiply with 1. Any number times 1 is still that same number. Look at this. If you put three red dots one time into a circle, you only have three red dots. 1 times 3 equals 3. If you have one red dot three times in circles, 3 times 1, it's still 3. You still only have 3 dots. So any number, like 3, when it's multiplied by 1, keeps who it is. It keeps its identity. It stays that number. It stays 3. Let's look at this one. We have 5 worn dots, dots one time in a circle. 1 times 5 equals 5. Now we have 5 orange dots in their own circles. So if you have one dot five times, one, two, three, four, five, it's still five. One times five is five, and five times one is five. Any number multiplied by one stays that number. Let's look at this one. Twelve dots one time in a circle. One times twelve equals twelve. Now we have twelve circles with one little dot in it. It's still twelve. If you have one dot 12 times, you still have 12. Look at this. 796 times 1 is 796. It stays who it is. Even a big number like 14,254, if you multiply it by 1, it's still 14,254. So when you're looking at the 1 times table, any number multiplied by 1 stays who it is, it keeps its identity, it stays itself. Remember the identity property, the product, which is the answer in times table, the product of any number times 1 is that same number. It keeps its identity, it stays what it is. 12 will stay as a 12. 500 will stay as 500. Multiplying by 1 is very easy because you know what the answer is going to be. It's the number that is being multiplied by 1. It's keeping who it is. We'll see you next video.